somebody getting humiliated in life or feeling humiliated, um, feeling that they were not treated as worthy, okay? And there's love here, but um, where's the value, I think? Um, and with this poor, uh, person, I'm getting the disappointment card, like somebody did get away, somebody got away. Um, and I and it came in the in the reverse, so I'm getting this vibe like you know, did this happen in the past? This happened in the past. Somebody got away or tried to get away, um, but oh wait, they're stuck. They're stuck, and maybe they were relieved that um, to put that they're trying to get relief. I think to put some disappointment behind them, um, but. They're not able to move on, okay? Um, what they value, they do value benevolence, okay? Um, I think that's the thing, right? We It's a true friendship, and we know we are the friends of the Zodiac. <laughs> Aquarians are. So I think they value that about you, Aquarius, that you have a friendly discourse, a friendly nature. I'm getting a lot of jumpers here. Um, but they also value um, having a sense of self-direction. I don't know if you can see that well. And um, having um, a varied life, okay? Having a life that um, is filled with challenge, novelty, and change. Um, what do you value? You want self-direction as well. You want you want your independence, okay? Uh, you do want to be self-reliant and self-sufficient. Um, you do want to achieve things in your life um, efficiently, competently, effectively, right? You also want to be empowered, empowered, okay? Um, but you might you might want to um, have more power in your relationships. Um, you know, I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to be straight with you. Like, mm, is Aquarius one that wants to control others, to dominate others? I don't really see us as that way. Um, but maybe some things have, you know, because we love to free people. We like to give people freedom, okay? Um, but maybe you're at a point now in your life where you wish that some relationships were more in your control or the things that have gone on in relationships that you had more control over it. Um because I don't think that, um, I, I, I'm getting kind of a loosey-goosey type of energy over here. Like, you want more things to be locked down and directed and achieving, you know, achieving things and, and having more empowerment where this person is kind of more open-ended and you're more, I don't know, it's, it's like you, you have, you have some expectations, Okay, about making progress in your life um, and, and getting victory in your life. Whereas this person, I don't see them so driven and motivated, to be honest. They don't share the same drive and motivation as you. Um, let's see what the advice is. Before I get on those closure cards, what is the advice, happiness? You know, you're going to have to go after your own happiness because I feel, again, I'm going to go back to this uh, that came out about your needs, you needing to let go and release and give up on things that are not making you happy or people in, in your environment that are going after their own happiness at any cost, which may be costing you your happiness, right? Um, you know, the advice here is what makes you happy, Aquarius. Um, and you need to, you need to think about this. You need to, uh, maybe not, not commit yourself to things, um, until, you know, you get clear about the sacrifices that you're willing to make for your happiness. Um, and for some of you right now, your happiness is just not committing to people, okay? Especially if they're not going to bring you happiness, um, don't commit to that. Um, use your time instead to get enlightenment about what's going to give you which fulfillment. 
Um, and if some of you are on hold right now because the spirit really wants you to take a time out and reflect on um, what what would make you feel um, fulfilled with your wishes, what would make you feel satisfied, uh, you have to reflect on this. But for those of you who are wanting to get closure in this relationship, I am getting this message. I just said no, what I didn't know. Well, there's a lot of not knowing here is what I'm seeing with these, um, you know, Hayman cards showing up um, in your advice and in their needs, okay? They need to know something. They need to come out of knowing what is what what sacrifices are required in a relationship. Um, I'm trying to move on, okay? Um, some of you, this is not, and that just popped out as well. Um, some of you, this is mentally moving on from something. Uh, we were so naive now that we know better. So much has changed. I do feel enlightenment is here on the table. Um, it's up for offering for both parties. But um, part of the enlightenment is understanding what needs to be sacrificed um, in order for this relationship to work. In order for both parties to be happy in their own right, in their own might, okay? Best of wishes.